for today's brunch i'm having this classic cup noodle chicken flavored uh, i bought this when i was in saipan it's quite hard to find it in korea i like this cup noodle because it reminds me of childhood i haven't eaten this in so long i don't know it's been like 10 years or something um i used to eat this all the time in like junior high school when i'll go to like after school i would buy this at the deli for like I don't remember how much it was then, maybe like 50 cents or 99 cents. Well, when I bought this in Saipan, it was 99 cents, so maybe it was cheaper back then. Mm. I never usually eat cup noodles first thing in the morning, but I'm kind of hungover from last night and I need a little hangover cure. Inside is the best part. kimchi laying around in my fridge that I wanted to get rid of it but I don't want to just make kimchi jjigae I found a recipe for kimchi kongnamulgo I love my bean sprouts and I love my kimchi so why not make a dish that has both of them it's my first time making this Very simple meal. Virtual assistant would bring up the results instantly. I call it Adam. You mean Siri? That's a great. Not bad for my first try. I definitely put in more kimchi than anything else, and it's really spicy. The difficulty level of this dish, since I'm a beginner, I would give it like a two star. Yeah, not difficult to make at all. You just gotta chop up the vegetables and put it in. Yeah. morning I had an early start to the day um, had to wake up at 6 30 to go to my morning radio show and I'm back and having my first meal at 11 a.m. I made myself a mango mango banana smoothie mango is one of my favorite fruits but I just can't eat it too often because it's pretty darn expensive here in Korea but one of my friends who um, came over recently, got it for me as a housewarming gift, so yeah, and it felt like making a smoothie today. Today, I'm having Korean beef, hanu, and I'm also going to reheat the kimchi kungnamukguk I made last night. Oh, what's up? 
I'm gonna eat this pasamsa kimchi bokbumbap. So busy, busy, busy. Oh my gosh, that looks so delicious. Okay, the meat has already gotten cold, so let's eat. Sometimes I wish I had like a portable grill so I can eat while cooking the beef at the same time because you gotta eat this when it's hot. It's not as good when it's cold. Mm. Today's brunch menu is avocado toast. We're gonna make smashed avo, so check it out of the show. I'm gonna add a bit of salt and pepper. realized I'm matching with my meal. Green cup, green avocado toast, green shirt. Open avocado toast number two. This time I'm gonna put Mike's hot honey on top of it just to see what it would taste like. This Mike's Hot Honey is so good with pizza. I've only tried it with pizza, but here it says to enjoy on pizza, fried chicken. Oh, fried chicken, that sounds good too. Cheese, tea, salad, ice cream, fruit. Fruit? Roasted veggies, seafood, yogurt, ribs, oatmeal, cocktails. But let's see what it tastes like on avocado toast. like sweet and savory at the same time pretty good but good thing I only put it on half of the toast because I think if I ate both toast like this I would have gotten kind of sick of it dinner is salad from this place called it salad I feel like it's just easier to order salad than try to make it myself because all of the veggies that I end up not using and leaving in the fridge go bad. It makes me so sad to have to throw those veggies away. I got a refreshed salad. It has kale, apple, kidney bean, red onion, cherry tomato, roasted shrimp, grapefruit, dried cranberry, lemon peel, and the dressing is virgin olive oil plus salt plus pepper plus lemon squeeze. Hmm. And I stopped by a bakery and got myself a sourdough bread and I'll have one slice of sourdough bread with my salad. So since it's a chopped salad, um, it'll be easy to just put on my bread and eat it together. This is the dressing. Very little. You cut it off. So I'm just gonna have the 
middle slice, the biggest slice. It's got cranberry and walnut inside. This is my very simple breakfast today. Got a croissant fresh from the bakery from yesterday. We have some grapes. We have hot black coffee. Aren't these utensils so cute? It seems like I've been eating a lot of bread lately, but I swear I don't usually eat this much bread. I got a feeling I'm gonna start having bread for breakfast a lot more often since there's a really good bakery store that open near my house. Best way to eat broccoli, no doubt. 